everyone, I'm Simon Toast Ken, and that is Buff Pro. Welcome back to one of our old favorites. One of my favorites, anyway. Just the 90 Day Fiance Show on TLC. Now, we got a special couple for you here today. We got a man that has two guinea pigs and more. Not only does he have two guinea pigs, he also is a pro gamer. He's, well, I don't know if he's pro or not, but he's ranked in RuneScape, which I'm not even too sure how they rank that. I've never looked into... RuneScape, right? But RuneScape is a very old, like, uh, I think it's like what the OG MMORPG, isn't it? Yeah, it's like the, the MMO before MMOs. Yeah, yeah. So he's a, he's a gamer and he's meeting his fiance for 90 days and it just hits hits close to home to me and I'm sure to Dane as well. As you're trying to game and this foreign chick is coming there yelling at you for playing your game, you know? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what they're all about. I beg any bigger that fire truck. My name is Clayton. I'm 30 years old. I'm a cybersecurity analyst, and I live in Lexington, Kentucky. Oh, he's one of those blue eye guys. Blue eye people don't have like a normal like resting eye profile to where like you know your your, your eyes kind of your eyelid touches the top of your <laughs> like yeah your, yeah you gotta always stare at people wide eyed when you have blue eyes like that you know <laughs> hello everybody you stare into your <laughs> soul all what you do <laughs> <laughs> I have. Two guinea pigs, baby pig, and chocolate. They have a right. noise, a specific noise. Hmm. He ain't lying. Guinea pigs. I had a friend when I was growing up. I'd go and stay at his house. The guinea pig was like in a container or whatever, but it's not the floor, like by the end of his bed. And at night, you'd be in there trying to sleep, and it's in there like, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> like, the whole night, and you're like, bro, how do you sleep with this? When they're hungry, they'll make a noise. It's called weaking. It's like, weak, 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 weak. Oh. It was just hungry all the time. That's what it wow. is. He was, he was only like <laughs> was only like ten, you know. So I guess he just never fed, fed his guinea pig. <laughs> no, I specifically remember that thing had like the pellets in there all the time. That, that sucker was well. It was a fat guinea pig. He was just still hungry. <laughs> I love my guinea pigs a lot, but they're not my only roommates. I'm gonna get lots of bones and lots Jesus of Jesus Christ. I also have two chihuahuas. <laughs> two chihuahuas. This one right here is uh. <laughs> Chihuahua's thick. <laughs> that one had all the Taco Bell. <laughs> that one wasn't like, yo quiero. That one was like, me, me, me gusta. <laughs> I also have two Chihuahuas, Coco and Buster. Oh. Your breath stinks. Oh, God. It's Coco's birthday. No! Get, get the monster. <laughs> <laughs> That's a buster right there. I have one last roommate, and that is my mother. Where's mama? Uh, Where's your mama? Ah, uh, that guy, man, I just can't get over how fat these dogs are. They're, they're very well loved. Yeah. I mean, they're old, so when, when the dogs get older, a lot of times they do get thicker like that because they move around less, but still, the dog's is obese. Where's mama? Where's your mama? Where's the mom at? There she is on the... On the Oh God, I thought she was in the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Where's mom? I'm the job. What is going on here? I'm taking a poo. Leave me alone. <laughs> Mom's just in there on the bed and the floor. I've been kind of just looking at their house, like their living situation, and it is odd. It, it gives me um, kind of vibes. It's giving me like... um. I don't know, your first apartment when you're at college kind of vibes. You know, he's got, yeah, here's just a yeah. chair with a blanket over it. You know, you, someone has just moved in. They got all their stuff in the, in the <laughs> containers. In their, in their yeah. It's like they're on their way to be a, being hoarders, but they're not quite there yet. So anyway, he lives with his mom. I'm sure okay. that his, his fiance, 90 day fiance is going to love that. <laughs> be just yeah, yeah, be livid just about it. Which is an interesting thing to me about this show is because it's like they got 90 days. It's kind of usually when they start dating, it seems like on the show almost like they finally have met each other for the first time. And they're like, your mom's got to move out. It's like, girl, you were here for 90 days. If we decide <laughs> to get married, then we'll have that discussion. Until then, leave my mom alone. You know, I need I need someone to help me pay rent. Right. Come on. You don't bark at mama's. Come here. Come on. She got in there. She's just like living in a closet. What is it? What is this? Oh, that is a closet, bro. He's got his mom in a closet. Dude, what? My mom lives in like mm. a walk-in closet so she can save up money to get her own place. Oh. We lived in this apartment about three years. What? She, okay, she's been trying to save up to get her own place for three years? Okay, all right, all right. <laughs> mm, mama ain't been working that whole time, guaranteed. <laughs> this was just a temporary. A little bit longer than temporary, <laughs> but it's working out. 
It's going to be okay. It's working out. I'll just stay in this closet as long as I can. <laughs> yeah, temporary, you know. Temporary, semi-permanent, you know, just however long it needs to be. She got her Bible out over there? What is that she's reading? She up at, oh, she, yeah. She's in the back. She's reading Revelation back there, too. Better watch, oh, oh, man. Better watch out. Uh, that's why she's prepared in the closet, bro. Revelation gets scary. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> you know, old girlfriend that we haven't met yet, better watch out because mom's reading Revelation. <laughs> Maybe the end of times. That's all I'm saying in this house. <laughs> Not for mom, though. She's in her closet ready to go. She's, all right, That's her Listen. prayer closet, Dane. <laughs> Dude, have, you ever, have you ever heard that term, the prayer closet? Uh-uh. That might be a Southern Baptist thing that's just like, you got to go get in your prayer closet and pray for like five hours or whatever it is the, the preacher always tell you every time. Go get in your prayer closet. <laughs> if you know what I'm talking about, then, then you know. If, <laughs> if you don't, maybe you ain't Southern enough. And it's only going to get more difficult because in a few days, the love of my life, Anna Lee, is going to be moving in with us. Anna Lee. <laughs> Anna Lee? Oh, surely he said Anna Lee? Anna. Okay. Anna Lee. It's like Anna Lee? Yeah. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> That's why mom was busting that revelation. Like, uh uh. Not at my house. <laughs> Sodomy's forbidden. <laughs> I know you. Dude, hold on a second. <laughs> She's like a younger oh, version of his mom wow. with good teeth. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yes. That's crazy. Their hair color is very similar. (laughs) (laughs) He likes what he likes, right? (laughs) Sigmund Freud's at the roll over his grave right now. Just like, I knew it! (laughs) I like to think that the years of watching Dr. Phil and all these other (laughs) other shows have prepared me to psychoanalyze things on the fly like this. (laughs) Like, wait a minute, that's his mom, sort (laughs) of. She visited my profile, didn't say anything. I just decided to be like, hey, you visited my profile and you didn't say anything anything hello <laughs> so that's that's kind of how it started <laughs> wow hey, yo girl i saw you looked at me and didn't like what you saw and you know i kind of like what i see so you know what's up you know you want me to teach you what's english going on, what's, what's going on here <laughs> so we're not going through the entire episodes we got we got the clips from tlc's youtube pulled up the next one the next clip we got is it, it dude <laughs> oh Anna Lee. wow yeah all right <laughs> All right. <laughs> Anna Lee gives Clayton blue balls. Oh my gosh. Come on. <laughs> not really? Like, not like this. Like, look, they're in the hotel. He's they, She's showing up. They He picked her up. They've gone to the hotel. I forgot the most important thing, believe it or not, because friction is not your friend. <laughs> and this blue. Rubik's Cube is in case she falls asleep and I get bored. You're busting out a Rubik's Cube? Seriously? <laughs> Lube and a cube. Lube and a cube. <laughs> Boy, that's the combo right there. <laughs> <laughs> the lube and the cube. Oh my god. That lube's not even for what you think, Dane. That's for when he has a the Rubik's Cube. It really gets in the <laughs> Yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> Doing a Burma's palms, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. All right, hide the cube. <laughs> the cube is what he has to hide. Ah, yikes. He's leaving the lube out, but you know, the cube, that's a little weird. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Oh no. Oh, no. oh no! I mean, the body language already—that's being given off—is very uh. Mm. Yeah. Just from the kind of way she looks at him, like the smile when you see someone you haven't seen in like five years in the grocery store, you're like, "Hey, oh god!" <laughs> right, know, right. You're dying oh. on the inside. It's like the look she's oh, giving I'm him here. <laughs> yeah, and then, and then the blue balls. Oh, oh no. The surprise <laughs> is that he is waiting for you. Quizás él pensaba que estaba viéndose como un modelo, pero yo lo vi como una vaca. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh no. She hates him. Oh god. Wow. Uh, no way this couple makes it 30 days. <laughs> Let alone 90. Why is she here? Like I, that, I so, don't know. How do you think oh. about that? She walks in. Wow, look at this cow. Also, imagine, imagine if he came in and said that about her. Imagine. Right. <laughs> oh, wow. Sí, estoy tan estresada. Yes. Bueno, ver. Voy a quitarme esto para que puedas. No, oh, get oh, the, oh, the old classic move of um, do you want a massage and it goes sensual. Guys, guys, he's got the candles lit and everything. Yeah, it's such With a the cameraman still in the room. I wonder how many girlfriends he's had if he's still pulling out the old massage. The old massage maneuver. That's like, (laughs) that's base level trying to make a move. I mean, it works though, I guess. So go for it. Yeah. Not in this case. Do you like me, circle yes or no? (laughs) 
I mean, like, do you want a massage? Everyone goes, yeah, I want a massage. Massages are great. But then like the, the expectation that it'll go somewhere. That's the, uh, yeah. Yeah. No. You'll see. Just got to let him know right off the rip. Oh God. It's hurt. Oh, no, he's it's, really trying. It hurts me. Let the camera people leave and then go get blue balled. Oh, God. That's why she was like, aren't you tired? And he's like, nope. And she's, she's like, like oh, I well, am. I am. I'm just letting you know I'm going to bed. I'm real tired. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm? I'm so sad, honey. <laughs> she let him know. I guess we're going to go turn the uh, lights out. We're going to sleep. Yeah, yeah, because we're going to bed. <laughs> we're going straight, we're tired. straight to sleep. Well, that Rubik's Cube's going to get worn out tonight. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 God. Imagine you've been dating this person online and, you know, it, you you get into like some pretty heavy topics because you all, you, you know, it's just text and, oh, man, they get dirty in them, right? And then she go, comes all the way up. Flies in, takes her to a hotel room. Finally, they love each other so much. And she gets there and goes, you look like a cow. I'm going to sleep. <laughs> oh, no. Sabes que significa huevos azules? Do you know what blue nut means? Peyotas azules? No. Okay, te cuento. You see, give her the whole explanation here about blue balls? Okay, te cuento. They fall off. Sus testículos están azules. <laughs> okay. Huh. All right. Well, that's that clip. Then we move on to the next one. Uh, is Clayton spending too much time on the computer? <laughs> this is the part that I actually thought was going to be the interesting part. Oh. <laughs> Hi. 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 Mm. Muchas cosas. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm a lot. I ain't playing my game and I don't really want to have to explain it to you because you're not going to get it anyway. Uh, it's como you're like an isolated boy. Aislado, no sé, es it's so hard. Tan I don't know. Maybe if you didn't have blue balls and you called him a cow. You know? <laughs> <laughs> right? Maybe if he didn't obviously know this relationship wasn't going anywhere, he'd be more interested in doing things with you. I just kind of wonder what he's doing with all his monitors turned off here, too. What just causes? Ya enviaste las invitaciones? Of course. <laughs> and to me, Cameron. I hope he can come. Oh, they have a wedding plan, too. Okay. Oh, wow. I just like the way that it feels like watching these clips so far is that they they don't, they don't even know each other. Right, the way it's going. It's so awkward. Por fin, para que lo conozcas y le pidas well, a la vez. Well, be the best. Quizás que sea tu That's going to be your best man. Oh, yeah. ¿No te parece una buena idea? All right. I think it's a good idea. Sounds like a great idea. It's a buena idea, supongo. Yes, I guess, I guess it's good. You know, I sent, a, I sent him a message on Discord. He said, cool. So I thought it was done and dusted, you know. All right. I guess I'll go over there. Huh? It's just going to be strange meeting someone that I've virtually met a decade and a half ago. Pienso mm. que Mm, okay, so he's never actually met this guy in person. Ooh. Got you. Oh. Wow. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, he, ugh. You know, that, that <laughs> homie you've been, the, the home you've been playing games with for years, and you have, like, this mental picture of them in your head, and then you go meet him in real life, and it just ruins it. Oh, it's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> it's like whenever Howie finally comes around. We've been playing how, games with Howie forever. We're going to see him in real life and just be like, oh, boo. <laughs> <laughs> what to Howie. If you don't know who Howie is, he plays video games with us on the Toasty Games Channel. Check it out. Here's a clip. No! <laughs> look, man! Look! No! Please! I tried to stop him! Oh, you didn't expect the late introduction. Yeah, <laughs> oh, shout is. out, did you? Oh, gotcha. <laughs> All right. And then the last clip we have here is Clayton overshares about his sexless life. <laughs> is this the friend he's talking about? Oh. He's man in person? That hairdo, though. Dang. Dude! <laughs> Rocking it! That is smooth. <laughs> Dang, old Chris Pratt's back here in the background just watching him getting ready to do another voiceover. <laughs> this old doodad right there. Okay. But also uh, virgin because I'm effectively living as a virgin because we haven't ha been having sex recently. So <laughs> I just figured I'd share that with you. Oh! <laughs> oh! He 
he's just hanging it oh. out. He's just hanging. <laughs> like she. That was so spiteful, bro. That was so spiteful. Oh man, wow. I, gotta, I gotta check the comments on this real quick to see what side everybody's on. <laughs> yeah, <please. laughs> How disrespectful and weird to him. She needs to run and, and go home. Like we haven't, we don't have all the context for this show, but just from the clips we've watched, she hates this dude. <laughs> she yeah. does not like him at yeah. all. <laughs> they both need to run. <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, anyways. <laughs> I know what those eyes mean, man. Shut up, shut What's up. What's she gonna do? Not, not have sex with me? Oh, God. God. Oh. Jeez. All right. Well, he's done, dude. This is the end of the relationship. So, guys, we uh, <laughs> we flew all the way over here to ask you to be my best man at my wedding. <laughs> By the way, we're publicly fighting in front of you sarcastically. Oh, man. Wow. Yeah, take a drink, Chris Pratt. Go ahead and take that drink. It's, it's yeah. real yeah, out here. Yeah, with me. I need one. Jeez. <laughs> So uncomfortable for me. It's disrespectful because I'm at the table. Yeah, it'd be way better if you weren't at the table, right? It'd be <laughs> imagine them saying this behind your back. Oh, like no, I don't. I, I do not think him doing that's okay. Don't don't get it twisted. I, I do not. I'm just t looking at the the whole relationship from like the four clips we've watched so far. It's just like right. I'm, I'm not surprised. Is all I'm saying. <laughs> She's just staring at her like. Yeah, she wants to take her, but like, yo, you know, okay? since I've been out to drink and heard so much about someone's sex life in such detail. The lack thereof. Like, <laughs> uh. Such detail. Yeah, what detail is there to tell? They're not doing anything. Right, Feeling yeah. Toward their sensitive conversation. Yike. Yike. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yike. Oh, mine's plural, Ooh. though. You know, yikes. yikes. <laughs> uh. It's exactly how I feel. He and her deserve everything they tolerate. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Everything they tolerate funny. from each other is exactly what they deserve. Golly. Wow. Mary's told me about this couple, too. I forgot she told me about <laughs> well, it. Uh, this, this couple, too. One. Apparently, there's clips of like them in the house, and he's trying to like he's trying to get them some. And it's like, it's because the mom lives there. And she's like, no, your mom's here. Oh. <sighs> Which I think, uh, just judging from, again, what little have you seen is a convenient excuse that she, she just, no. Nah, oh, this, yeah, she's this, not. This relationship is done. This this is yeah. more obvious than Big Ed's relationships being done. Like, yeah. they're, they're just, oh, for real, dude? They're not even pretending in this one. This is just nothing. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. That is the end of this. That is uh, Clayton and uh, Anna Lee. <laughs> if you want us to do more about this couple let me know in the comments you know if, if it gets a whole bunch of views and all that cool stuff and people are like yes do more then we'll do more uh, but until then there's your birthday happy birthday thank you my friends i love you see you next time bye yike